Hello and welcome back. Sorry about the delay, I've been pretty busy. Uh, what are we doing today? Storing and displaying death coordinates. Okay. First things first, let's get three objectives to store them in. Create objectives. That's not how you spell objectives. Although it doesn't matter because it's just a sign. Scoreboard objectives. Add player death. X, it's a dummy, shift home, copy all of that, done, paste it in there, you can probably guess what this one's going to be, player death Y, done, paste it in there, and you definitely guess what this one is then, player death Z, okay, let's create them, now we'll store them, so we've got create, and we'll have store coordinates, Okay, we are going to execute and we're going to store a result as a score. We're going to st store it on the nearest player. You can obviously put any player you like there. And we're going to store it in their player death x value. What are we going to store in there? Data get from an entity. I'm going to get it from me. My last death location because zero zero is x let's copy all of that again i think you can probably guess what we're going to do we're going to change that to y and y is cos one and we're going to change this one to z and z is cos two done now let's display it Let's display it in chat. So chat done button. It's going to be quite a long command this one. So I think we'll just do the X first, and then we'll we'll copy that. So let's start with tell raw who can see it. Nearest player. You can put anyone you like there. And let's open and close square brackets. We're going to have a bit of text in there. So let's just say. Speech marks, speech marks, colon, speech marks, speech marks, and we'll have a bit of color as well. Text, death, coordinates, there we go, and let's put a space, and color, um, red, make it stand out. Okay, and then we'll have a comma, and we'll have some more text, so let's have another couple of those speech marks, speech marks, colon, speech marks, speech marks and we're going to change the color so we're going to have text x and this color something something different from the red probably something like gray fray <laughs> gray there we go and then after that we'll actually put the score so the score will go in here. Speech marks, speech marks, colon, open and close brackets. Score. And the score will need speech marks, speech marks, colon, speech marks, speech marks. Speech marks, colon, speech marks, speech marks. We do lots of those in these messages. So we're going to have a name. And the name will be at P. Now we're going to have an objective, objective, and the objective will be player death x. I'll tell you what, shall we do some color as well? Yeah, so after the score bit, let's put color, we'll make it green, green, okay. Done. So we've created the objectives. Let's store my death coordinates and let's display them. So I last died at 28, which is over here somewhere. There it is. That down here. So we've done one. It's quite long. Okay, so end. Let's go right to the end and we'll go here. So next we will do another bit. 
and then there we're gonna say I'm gonna stop saying speech marks speech marks colon speech marks speech marks because I'm just saying it too much and we'll have there we go so this is going to be a bit of text text and what we'll have is we'll need a space y color I think we did it gray last time didn't we gray okay and then after that we'll have another one and this one's going to be a score so speech mark speech mark colon and open and close bracket going to be a score it's going to have a name the name is going to be the nearest player it's going to have an objective and the objective is going to be player death y and where do we put the color just after this bracket here color oh, I think we did green green done nice and then we just need the last one which is going to go here so in there we're going to have some text and we're going to have a color what text are we going to have it's going to space z and color gray okay we seem to have made a mistake What mistake have we got? Let's cut this. X. So that's fine. Okay, so we've got Y equals color equals green. Okay, well, this looks fine. What have we done wrong here? Color equals green. Comma. Let's just try some text first. Text. There we go. That's better. Space Z. Give it a color. Color. No, gray. Let's just do a little check on that. Yeah, there's the Z showing up. And then after that, we're gonna have a score. Boy, this is a long one, isn't it? And the score is gonna have a name, and the name is gonna be a selector. Selector is the nearest player. And we need an objective. And the objective is going to be player death Z. Done. Oh, it didn't change its color. Let's change its color. Color green. Hey, <laughs> we put it in the wrong place, didn't we? Yeah, look, let's cut that out. X, and it's supposed to go there. There we go. Okay, so we've got our death coordinates showing up in chat. Let's uh, let's kill ourselves and see if they change. Um, what are the coordinates of on top of here? Still, touch a tab. Thirty-one fifty-seven six. Okay, let's go on there. Ow. Okay. Let's go and pick up my stuff. Don't be messy. Store the coordinates. Display them. 31576 excellent okay last thing to do then let's get them displaying in uh, on a sign so we'll need a sign there's a sign let's point at it fill tab 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 to get its uh, coordinates copy maybe say sign there okay now this one this one's a little bit shorter uh, data merge with the block uh, where is the block? There's the coordinates we just copied. And we'll have open and close. Okay, first things first. Text. Two. We're going to put it on the second line. Colon. 
just do apostrophe. In there, we're going to have square brackets. Inside the square brackets, we're going to have curly brackets, comma, curly brackets. That's going to be a bit of text. And this one is going to be the score. Okay, let's start filling this in. First one is going to be text. It's going to say X with a space. This one is going to be a score. So it's going to have a name, which is the selector, which is the closest player. What score? So what objective? Player dot X. Okay, done. Nice, we've got 31. Let's just check that 31, 31, okay. And then after here, we will do a comma. Is that the right place? Yep, and we're gonna do the next one. Text line three, apostrophe, apostrophe, square brackets. Okay, the first one is gonna be text. The next one is gonna be the score. So inside there, more of these. We use a lot of these when we're doing this stuff. Text Y space score name at P objective player death Y done fifty seven yep pop in for the next one right at the end there let's uh, get another comma and then text four and uh, there should be the square brackets we're going to have text and we're going to have a score that will be the text and this one will be the score and we know what this is going to say this is going to say z Z space. This is going to say score. This is going to say name again. This is going to be the selector. We're going to say it's an objective. And what objective is it? Player, death, and Z. Done. Press that button. There's the Z. There. So we've created the objectives. We've stored the coordinates of, well, I picked the nearest player, so that's me. We stored the coordinates. We can put them in chat and we can put them on a sign. There we go. Okay, that's it. That is how we oops, sign in my face. That's how we uh, grab the co death coordinates of a player and then display them in chat or onto a sign. Okay, I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.